trust that from these conversations, lives will be enhanced and that your truth will be revealed. Help me speak as your servant and as your oracle. Let the conversations of my lips bring glory to your name. Amen. Let Jesus be glorified. Amen. Let your people be edified. Amen. And Lord, let Satan continually remain terrified in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for the Spirit of God. Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Alright, I want to just speak to those questions and perhaps I'll just go to what I want to teach tonight. Is that okay? Yes. Quick, let's try that. First question, scriptures. The way it works is that whenever there's a need, there's grace. Do you agree with that? Yes, do, you, do you know where I got that statement from? Wherever there's a need, there's grace. Where did I get that statement from? Yes. But there's a clear scripture that handles this. Prayers and supplication. No. Let us come to let us come boldly before the throne of grace. I know one long one over here. Let us come boldly before the throne of grace that we might obtain mercy and find grace to help in need. Once there is a need, there is a grace. If you met someone now that wants you to counsel and the demand of that conversation makes you have to speak like a pastor, intelligence, wisdom, grace, is made available to you like a pastor. If, for example, there's nobody to play keyboard in a church, and there's this example I've made before, but the pastor who taught me, Pastor Tunejaebo, I God bless you, sir, wherever you are. May the Lord honor you, Jesus. I will never forget that evening. It was a six o'clock Tuesday. T- is it Tuesday or Thursday? One of the T's, because I know I didn't go out there. So they came to campus to do street jam. Oh, 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 oh. Do you want a revolution? Oh, oh. I said, who are these people? Hey. Where me am? I was already feeling like his team where I was on campus. That they never had for this guy. Now some do revolution. I chased the church. Who did you Oshun, Oshun, Avenue or something. So that evening at 6 o'clock, there was no lights. It was a duplex like this. <laughs> the man put chalkboard. And I asked this question. I said, sir, I was bubbling. That was where virtues was cooking my spirit. It was just, I've not yet hatched it. Everything in my heart was jiving. You know, I don't know if you know. Muti kabai, muti, muti kabai, muti. That was the prayer. That, after that time, I said, I was looking for dinner. I said, sit down, yeah, come on, say, come on, say. So I was loaded. Ah! I was, when you say, I was drooling. drooling blood of Jesus. You know when you study and you know you are not normal. I don't know if you I don't know if you have ever reached there. I don't know. I hope you know, someday you get what I mean. I was tripping. But I knew that I needed wisdom. I knew. So I sat at the back. That's why I asked question for night. So they won't say, let us close. <laughs> That's I have question. I have question. And I said, sir, as I speak, sir, sometimes I have congestions in my heart that makes me feel the necessity to do certain things. And this is what I want to do. So he now said this scripture to explain my question, which I've not yet told you my question, so you don't think you're going to have a question. He now explained the scripture that whenever there's a need, he said, there's always grace. I've never had it before. He said, if we need a music director now, maybe we go to a village and we need a music director. The need for it means grace is available. Mm. For anybody who can plug in there, he will operate like he's a music director. Mm. I say, what? Simple man, you need to see him talk like a stammerer. Mm. Hey, what did you say, Yoku? Don't ever think that the popular is the only one God called you. Yeah. Yes, Today, I saw him he's preaching for Pastor Shola Arewu in Oshodo this coming soon. And I saw him. I don't know whether they are doing it now. So. I was so happy. I said, thank God this man is called. I, you know how I was, I, I, I believe one day I will call him and honor him in this church. I think he deserves it. He doesn't know how much that statement helped me. That once there's a need, you are in your house, somebody is sick. There is a need for healing. There is grace for healing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anybody can you the best thing would be like as he's a pastor. Mm. 
because there's a need for a healing power. I don't figure what I'm saying. Yes, sir. So when there's a need for a counselor, there is grace for counseling on the person who steps into that shoe. Someone is having a problem and they say, we don't know what to do. In your house, maybe somebody is saying rubbish. You will find out that if you are conscious about what I'm telling you and you step into that shoe, you will find grace to speak in that capacity. Like as if that is your calling. But that might not be your calling. Hmm. The need made you useful. The need made, yes. Need. For every need, there is supply. I, I have a similar experience as well. Okay. So I used to play keyboard in my church when I was young. Shady you. So, <laughs> you play keyboard. So, about a year later, yeah. I traveled back. I was in another church. Give me keyboard, give me keyboard. So okay. I, nothing came out. Nothing will come out. It's not what baby. It's not what baby. You will find that if there is a bass guitar on the ground and there is really a need for bass guitar and you play something to it, it will enter. Let the real person that knows how to play come. You just let everything fit. If there is a need for a preacher and you are preaching and a preacher now arrives, your message will stop flowing. It will be like need points to supply. Is not supply existed before the need. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This I'm telling you is a powerful principle. So whenever I see need, it's a proof of supply. For God shall supply oh. according to his riches in glory. Which one existed first? His riches in glory existed before the need showed up. <laughs> ah, believe me, sir. Any need is a pointer to supply somewhere. Once you see the need for, if you need money, money is somewhere else. If you need car, I promise you, car is waiting. The day you decided to choose a car you want to buy, you'll be seeing the car everywhere. You never notice. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You just decide on the phone you want to buy now. Yes, Bam! The phone yes. starts to be everywhere. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Just yes, sir. Advert, everywhere. Now it's even worse because. Even on this is here also. Yes, 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 sir. As you say phone now, you can start to see phone. Which one do you want? Which one is my phone? You just say MBA. As I'm talking now, you see MBA yes, is on your phone. Yes, sir. <laughs> There's such a thing called the personal recognition system. Hmm. It will just start to come up to you. So what's my point? Need is a pointer to supply. And it will answer to anybody that steps into that capacity at that time. So the relevant scriptures are made available to you. When we need a preacher, preaching is granted to the person who is ready to step into that capacity. When we need a singer, I was in Zampara, I was music director. Of the whole YouTube, I don't know if you know what I'm saying. Amy. It was even El Living Faith Man. Living Faith World uh, Winners. You know, there's joints, uh, there's NCCF, this thing. There was a music director for that one. Me, they now made me music director NCCF. Music director. now stand to truth. You got faith. <laughs> Just present a need, supply will show up. Look at when we needed an admin. A medical student. I be not student, but I beg your pardon. A medical personnel, a consultant, I'll be whatever. Yeah, you're not a student, sorry. A medical person, that's a forgive that I forgot that adjective, stepped in and he's doing that. You almost forget he's a medical practitioner. And that's a practitioner. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. I forgot all those things that I, I didn't know it in school. Let there be need, there will be supply. Sure, you get it. Yes, so that scripture that came to you, and the good thing is that the need met the scriptures within you. If you were not having small scriptures, you will be quoting in the beginning, God created the house and the So it's because you had it, or John, this is a proposal of God. How does that concern the need at hand? So the Holy Spirit will take advantage of the resources within you and make them float to solve the need at hand. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes, After that period, you might not even remember anything. You can become an Oludu after that one. But that one that we need, 
I, do you know that there are some things that are in you now? That is until there's a need for it that you now start to see that. Yes, yes, yes. I know this thing. Yes. Because there's no need. That's why you have to be exposing yourself. What I'm doing now, your needs is bringing out the wealth in me. I'm using you to grow. I've grown before, but if you don't have need, I'm in trouble. Yes. That's how systems operate. Needs make supplies relevant. So just imagine supply is being waiting, 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 waiting. I want to go to the art. I want to go to the art. It's a need that will make him jump to the art. Mm. Mm. You guys get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Stop thinking need is bigger than supply. Supply has always been greater than need. There was one um, TV program that I used to watch in learning. It says, there are more questions than answers. <laughs> it's an old program. There are, this will take place 10 o'clock. There are more questions than answers. I said one day, I came back, I said, no, there are more answers than questions. There are more answers than questions. Your ignorance of the answer does not mean there are no answers. So that's how that one goes. Number two, the question about alternatives and worst, worst case scenario. Please, let's take care of our children, please. Huh? Thank you. This children can show us. Thank you. So, the other one is worst case scenario. Let me just tell you something about faith. Faith is very stubborn. You hear me so? Faith is very stubborn. Now, let me say this to you also, just for, for this, like an advanced class statement. Are you listening? Yes. Faith, the testimony of faith is not that the prayer was answered. The testimony of faith is not that you got the answer to your question. The testimony of faith is that you believed God. Wow. Yes. Yes. The real reward of faith is that you believe God, not that the answer came. Right. Ah. Ah. If you trust God for healing, or that someone should be healed, and the person is not healed, and the person dies, you are God is glorified that you believed Him, even though the outcome was not so. That is where God is glorified. That you believed him regardless of the outcome. Kaya. Listen, oh, hmm. Jesus stayed in the garden for three hours, said, Lord, let this cup pass over. Go the answer. <laughs> three hours. Jesus, please, after Jesus. May Jesus go send me after Jesus, there's nobody out to see. He's our pattern son. Our testimony is not because we got the answer, it's that we believed God and love not our lives even unto death. <laughs> That's why I say, take your mind up from using God as a solution to your death, or God forbid, you are not dying in Jesus' name. Amen. But Amen. the loss of that thing does not unseat God. It does not. Those three book boys got it right. Said, we're not going to bow. Our God is able to save us. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He said, if he now doesn't save us, that, we can handle it. Deal with it. Jesus did not appear to them before they entered the fire. That's were you joking inside that place? Were you, were you, did you really mean what you said? He did not appear to them before. The people that were to throw them inside the fire were consumed. Yes. To show you that that fire was not ordinary. They now enter the fire finish. Because he was there. It was the king that God opened his eyes. He said, the fourth man there is like the son of the living God. Kaya. Yeah. No other person. Kaya. Eh? It was not so much about, that's why I said, don't be confused that you use faith, it didn't work, and you backslide, which is coming to your own question. Mm. And yeah, well, I trusted God, it didn't work. 
Faith is not for to prove it worked or it don't work. Are you listening? The joy is that you believe God. Yes, sir. Now let me quickly go to that Poland's question. I'll come back to your question. Because that your question is ultra ultra world. I'll come to it shortly. You see, the best way to believe God for anything is not just to know what they are saying, it's to know what they want to give you from grace, right? Hmm. Yes. Grace friend has supplies. They have an opinion to what you can eat. You to have an opinion to what you want to eat. Do you get? Grace friend says we have jollof rice for you, but you say you want to eat indomie. I need something to handle this situation. That what? Wow. Can't take this spot. I said I'm expecting this. So the way it works is that there is no way if heaven has something for you already, that's why we pray for the will of God. Are you listening? Yes, sir. That the will of God should stand in your life. When Jesus was praying that prayer, he said, Lord, not my will. But thy will be done. Your will might not be a sin, but the will of God is greater. I don't think you heard what I just said. Let me repeat it. What you want might not be a sin. If a sister wants to marry a brother, and what she wants is a particular brother, that brother might not be a bad person. But God has an opinion about who you should marry. So instead of ordering for your own brother, why not ask for the will of God for what he wants to do? That is the best. You can't be wrong that way. You can't be wrong that way. So, is yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. She might not like the penny. Is what God wants for you. Ah. Yes. Thank you, mama. Like that, like it might not be like it might not be like it now. Yes. But because God sees the end from the beginning, He knows that this is the So best. what is most important is to be sure that this is what God wants for me. Mm. That's mm. Google. Yes. Mm. Not that I arranged it. I got it somehow. The Israelites didn't want a king. God gave them a king because they insisted. Mm. But that was not God's best for them. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, so sir. the question is: Is this what the Father wants? For yes, sir. Me? That is the best place to stay. Yes, sir. So how do we stay at the center of God's will? That is what prayer does for us. Mm. Prayer subjects your will to the will of God. Hallelujah. That's what prayer does. Mm. It wrestles with my will to come under the influence of the will of God. Mm. My own appetite. That's what Jesus too did. I know. Yes. I yes, sir. I know. Yes, sir. Three hours. Yes. yes. Negotiating with God. Yes. Mm. Yes. And the prayer made him rest. I said, Not my will. What I will. Prayer made him submit to the will. God must. Is there no other way? Mm. Prayer. Anybody that can pray has a pot of the opportunity. Because let me give you the Prayer is like so, so there's a veil for what your life should have looked like. We don't know it. I mean, we don't know what your life should have looked like. Yes, so your life is like that. Maybe by now you should be somewhere in California doing some great scientific research. I don't know. It should come out to be smoking drugs. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Yeah. So maybe I come just as I said, California has been living a good life. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know, man. But that's good life coming that you are smoking drugs. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. So there's a feel what life could have looked like. We don't know it. What happens in prayer is that those short forms we replace those social capital. Yes, sir. If you want to listen to those messages, they are very useful. That social capital that your life should have had, that character of being not just a beautiful woman, but a, an intelligent, bright one, that will make you meet somebody that is your father's friend, that will sponsor you to a school that you can't afford, that will make you become better. Prayer replaces those lost issues. Mm. Yes. Prayer. Look, it will bring people, it will make people start to like you again. Yes, those sir. things that should have happened from childhood, those things that made your, your shape go out of shape, those things that made your life go out of function, 
prayer rearranges it. Yes, <laughs> and so you can just be there thinking that we are not praying about my life. Don't worry. Don't worry. That's why when we pray the Holy Ghost, you may think you are praying that, Lord, let your will be done in church. God is saying, look, you need an impact. Mm -hmm. Prayer. No, you read it. So prayer goes and fetches necessary vitals. That's why I look at you. If you don't pray, I just used to look. I don't know what you better tell you. Sir. Sir. Because prayer, like they say, your marriage is working. You need to pray. Yes, sir. Your marriage is not working. You need to pray. You don't have marriage. You need to pray. You want to be married. You need to pray. Prayer is what makes it stable. Mm. I don't know how else to say it. You have money. Pray. You don't have pray. It's the equilibrium for everybody to get what it needs. Yes, sir. So that thing you are saying about mentorship. Why I was bringing prayer into it. Your prayer now helps you meet the right way to. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Those people that met a wrong person and they were raped, it's not that like they wanted to be raped. Yes, sir. But somewhere there was prayerlessness that got them inside the mix. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, sir. Mm -hmm. Because if there was prayer somewhere, what angel would be the door before the lecture at those people? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If there was prayer somewhere before the accident, mm -hmm. something to have to The mm -hmm. <laughs> prayerlessness makes angels lose money. Oh, yeah. it, uh -huh. I'm telling you very truthfully. I'm telling you very truthfully. And I'm not just talking about vibrating alone. You should be eager to know the will of God. To know the will of God. Are you listening to what yes. I'm Prayer. I can't deceive you. You know, I, I, you know I can't deceive you. So, prayer now makes you meet the right thing that can facilitate that growth. Or ushering the new levels or dimensions of God's power, or whatever God wants to do. Although God wants to walk on His own earth, He needs men. If He doesn't find men, what God wants to do will be locked down. What God, not I just say man, what God wants to do will lock down. Uh -huh. Do you guys know that? Yes, yes, now you have a question. Sir, do you know understand? Yes, sir. 100%. See, if you are in a business, you know, I was saying something yesterday. Some people, something is going well in their lives now. And they are managing steady salary, steady friendship. Things are managing, at least, je, 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 je. You know, fine. It is prayer that will stabilize it. Mm. You see, prayer is an act of vigilance. Mm. It's not just like praying. Some of us will dream money prayers, especially. Don't be like that. Yes, sir. Don't be like that. Yes, sir. You know I'm not seeing you. Yes, sir. Don't be like that. Take it seriously. Take it seriously. Take it seriously. Yes, sir. If you sleep off, it's possible. I'm not saying you can't sleep. But don't be like it doesn't matter. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Something about to remove under your leg. Mm. Mm. You see, nothing happens without signals. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm. There's such a thing called signs that lead, signs that follow. Mm -hmm. If human beings must create structure, when you are about to enter a branch or an organization or a place, they show you a sign. This way, toilet. That spiritual realm is more organized than that. Mm -hmm. Before you enter trouble, a signal is pointing you out. Mm -hmm. That means it's hard for you to happen. I take you by surprise. What am I saying this to us so that you can know the power of prayer? Mm -hmm. Power of prayer. Power of prayer. Are you listening? Yes, yes, sir. Does prayer not make more meaning to you now? Yes, sir. Yes. 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 Good question. Thank you, sir. Yes. I was thinking I would go through um, faith and faithfulness messages again to get the answer. I don't need it. My yeah. question. Yes, sir. My question is um, maybe at the point in someone's life. Um, you trusted God for something, and at the long run, you now make it. I have it with that. You do this for me. You should get this. I will do this. I will do that, and the likes like that. Like uh, the Bible passage, Jesus, with Samuel, when 
and I just left them for some women and God gave me to me. And she already made a vow that if you give me this child, that I'll bring him to the house of, of the Lord. So at the point, maybe you now made a vow like that, and God now answered that prayer because she trusted him. And like then, the vow is something that's supposed to take a long time. And now did, you did this for a shorter period of time, and probably you were not chance to do them again and like that. And at the point is that anytime you now want to use your faith, you now be scared that I have not completed what I was supposed to do. Oh, okay. Can the God answer me like that, like that? So, so let me tell something. The problem with, you can see that. The problem is not with God. The problem is with you. You that you vow. Let's start with that. Why did you feel your vow? Was <laughs> if you now made that vow and you have known greater, and then you realize that that vow was an, a, an emotional discussion that you're just emotional about it, but I will give my son, I'll give my son. You now put the son inside the church of three minutes to say, Give me something like that. So the truth is that you have not done very well. The God will forgive you. He's not going to go to the ministry. And I assure you, he has actually forgiven you. It is you that need to now forgive us. Change again. But the part I want to draw your attention to is that it means the next time you want to engage your faith, you should be more alert. You should be more, you know, uh, more English, more, eh? more circumspect, more intentional, more, what's English, give English. Deliberate, eh? More conscious, more intelligent, more, more clear-headed. Eh? You understand? So that you won't be thinking what's in Joker. Yeah, because I should ask you to last week now, that don't make a vow in a hurry. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But they carry vow for you. I will give you Lord, half of my salary if I get this job. <laughs> you for me, you don't have salary. You don't see the half of your salary. You don't see that. Two million naira. So you don't be left with two million from four million. It's a lot. You know the way this thing works. Money, you won't feel it until it's more. More. Yes. 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 So that they say that church does not need that much. Right. It's very good. So I'm just using that to say be careful how you make it. And then if you made such a thing and all of that, and you feel so strongly that the yoke of it is strong on you, come to me and we lift that yoke of that's our job. Our job is to relieve people from you. So you no longer be under that body and be free to do it. Because sometimes you can't lift it yourself. Yes. That's our job. Any person that knows his correct is his work. It's our work. To lift the yoke of people and to command the blessing. Job. So if it's too much, come and pray for it. What did you promise? Go and children and no one. <laughs> <laughs> don't go against your foolishness. Yes. 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 How about blessed by this? Yes, sir. Yes. You see that questions sometimes are very useful. Yes, sir. Yes. Yes. It's not that we can't preach new message. It's that let this one that we preach enter. Let it enter. Eh. Let it enter. Is there no question on the angle of the new levels of victory through faith and faithfulness? I just want someone to ask me, because that's what I want to close with. On faithfulness, if the faithful man will abound with blessing, how does blessing become rich? I, mean, I thought somebody asked. Okay, I've asked. Now. What was the answer? I gave you guys a, a question last week or something, remember? Really research. Yeah? Really research. What's, what, what was the question of the research? Some of you do not do research. You don't even know there's research. So, the last was N. When people see it, yes. Is it that yeah. the eyes become more and more? Or the eyes get more? What's your answer? I'm not doing it. What's your answer? What's your question? I think so. Try. Okay, so when I did my findings, I looked at a typical example of angels appearing. For instance, when the angel appeared unto Mary, I felt like, uh, as you taught us on 
Chronos uh, uh, and Kairos, that by God's divine timing, at a certain time, like it is depending on the purpose for the appearance of that angel, the angel will appear either by divine, divine timing or by chronological timing. Like when Peter, uh, 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 Peter was inside the prison and they were praying, humans, men demanded an angel to appear and there was an appearance. So I, I think it can be either no, or wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. When, when, when Peter was inside the prison, and they asked for angel to come. They prayed. They prayed that an angel came. An angel came yes. as a solution yes, to, their prayer. to their prayers. So I'm saying that it can be both that men can call angels. Um, even God's divine timing. No, my question is not can men call angels. I said, when men see the angels, angels. it's that the angel came more to the world or the man went more to the city. Yes. That's really what I'm asking. That one is not exactly. eh? That's the only thing that has to do. And it's Anybody wants to try? Nobody. Everybody. You, you see, I'm not even trying anything. I'm just looking at slow. It's edgy. Yeah, that's how you feel. We are listening. Not the one that you will now get to reality. Because that's how you will hear message now. Reality will shape you now and say, Lord, I know this like this. It's like that too. It's like that. That's how you think that problem of life does not know your address. It knows everybody's address. <laughs> yeah. It's about to check that question. Let me think. You are just posting with AC tonight. No question. Nothing. What's your finding about that question? When angel shows up, did the man become more spiritual or the angel became more physical? Do you believe that people see angels? Yes, sir. So what? Using scriptures. All right, everybody got read first things. Did they hear me soon? Yes, sir. Read first things. Let's speak to the help someone. Chapter 6. Huh? Bring it up. Bring it up. Let me see first things. Huh? That question is Therefore sent he tighter horses and chariots, and a great host, and they came by night and compassed the city about. Verse next. Verse next. And when the servant of the man of God was risen early, and God forth, God forth, behold, and host compassed the city both with horses and chariots. And his servant said unto him, Alas, my master, how shall we do? Alas? He now said, and he answered, Fear not, for they that be with us are more than they that be with them. Are you saying it? Yes, Look at the next scripture. And Elijah prayed and said, Lord, I pray thee, open his eyes. He was not blind. <laughs> that he may see. And the Lord opened the eyes of the young man. And he saw. And behold, the mountain was full of horses and chariots of fire round about Elijah. So in this case, you have answered now. What's your question? Let's see. It's not that you should take it up and change the subject. What happened with Anna?
Mm. An angel filled you. An angel filled you on his task. It's not normal. There is a dying of the saints. Mm. We don't die anyhow. Jesus. I'm telling you the truth. That's something that I that the saints, he said, can't be cut off. He can cut his head off. <laughs> like James. Mm. Put his head on the spike. So that, that doesn't mean it should happen to everybody. Yes, sir. Mm. But the state of God, Hallelujah. who understands what I'm telling you, yes, sir. even to injure in your house is hard. Mm. So you just be injuring, injuring. It's normal. It's not normal. An angel is strong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not normal. Don't normalize normal. Mm. Say, Pastor, show to me. What you for you to go through a week or a month and there is no angelic intervention, prayerlessness is louder than you. I'm telling you, you may hey, 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 hey. no, let me just tell you, for starters, don't compare yourself with me. What I do, you don't know. Yes, sir. What I've done, you are not there. Yes, sir. Stop thinking we are mates. Yes, sir. <laughs> <You're down. laughs> do you know by the sheer office I carry, I have office apparent premier. Just by being a man of God. Yes, sir. Do you know there is an there is support for being a pastor? You are not pastor. And then you are feeling like you are pastor. You see? <laughs> <laughs> because it's a it's a trick. You just say you pastor is up. Do you think I'm a mate? Do you know the calling that brought me here? Do you know the God I have served? Have you done what I've done? <laughs> me that my sweat alone can bring healing. Yes, sir. The campaign. I'm not. I'm not just there. Nobody stands on this altar. An authentic man of God without the parallel office. Mm. It's not possible. There's a. We might not boast or brag about it anyhow, so that we're not careless. You understand? Yes, sir. But we don't stand before people just because we are. We have chest. No, unless you don't know your work. So I'm just telling you now. Don't be thinking that I didn't see pastor go to Lurik. The one I went to a you there. <laughs> I'm not trying to tell you. Do you guys know what I'm saying? Yes, I hope it's helps. So, um, so I think we dealt with this one. Wait in your question. So a newcomer of using feet. A newcomer of feet. Yes, yes, yeah. So I think you you were you already explained to us before now that um, I think it was two to say we see that start using your feet now, like start. Yes, feet. yes. So to somebody who has not be used to it. Yes. Okay. And the person has a big project and it's faithful. Start small. Start small. When you use your capacity to do something, the style of faith can carry it. Faith in that sense will be described like a muscle. You are not a gym. You are not a gym. gym you want to go for higher things because your mind is going, but your faith is small. Mm -hmm. So let your faith match your mind. Grow it, it's small, small. You will know how to do better. Okay, as I am like this, I want to drive Rolls Royce. I'm going too far. I want to feel some sort of start small, feel I see him. Do you understand? Grow small, small. Look, that's how some of us want to be suspended from the ground. <laughs> You are defying gravity. Grow mm -hmm. small, small. Are you using? I want them billion, billion, billion. <laughs> <laughs> so you start with I have one million. That's one million. Yes, sir. Hey, one million can become two million. That's small, small. But I say, no, I want to feed. I want to show my feet is strong. That's not the last thing your feet can do. What your feet should do. Your feet should be your lifestyle. You should still do more things. Yes, sir. I don't know if you guys get what I'm trying to say. Yes, sir. If you notice a kid here, trust God for the faith to heal it. Kimpu. Kimpu. Nobody will know that you are praying on it. She mm. was telling us one time, and I noticed a growth. Yes. And I said, Die! Yes, yes. Die! Yes. Die! I said, I died in Bodhi six months. It's no good. One when I just noticed it was gone. So it's like, it's not, there's nothing there now. Mm. No medication. And die, I talk, or did he die? <laughs> And I die, I talk. You see, look at this here. I don't know if you know. Mama, no. Now, here a day, I just started seeing growth. Growth, you are. Die. die. Now, die, I talk till you die. <laughs> I didn't come back to shout at this thing. So, 
It's not you on the trying to float in the cloud. Mm -hmm. Those feet for simple things. Mm -hmm. yes. That day they hit my hand, this finger on the door. Ah, and I was like, I had a voice telling me, you Michel. When I was in pain, I don't know if you know what it is. It's pain. And I had a voice asking, Is that you Michel? That's my angel asking the question. Very stupid thing. And I responded. I said, Hail! That's why I shout. Alone. With all vexation. God is witness, not in spinning me again. Yeah. No, from that place. You know, I said, Brethren, I had a God. Yes, what he's doing me. Don't touch my finger. Leave me alone. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to show you simple things. I saw a Q7, but I liked it. I said, Q7, you will come to my house. I did my research. Check, is it a good car? And I managed this car. Is it good came but we did it. I did the logical things I should do as a person. I didn't have all the money. When I was telling my mama, I said, send me what you have first now. I said, it's true. That's the advice I've given somebody to before. Yes, sir. As a type of need, I was thinking I needed to bring it to us. She just said, Send what you have, John. What's it? I said, It's true, sir. As I said, it's the next morning, bring it. She's here. So don't be waiting, no, Lord. I trust you. Relax. Hmm. I'm trusting you for a husband. Maybe the first two people will not be your husband. But they are the people that you use as the people to improve your character. Hey. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes. Say, no, Lord, let the one that come be my husband. Be a special unity. You know what? What's that? What's that? It's so true. I don't know. Don't sit down. 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 The first person, the first person, the first person now makes the first person cheaper. It's not cheaper. You know what I'm saying? So, calm down. Eh? Okay, when you are trusting God for something that does not yet happen, don't say it does not happen. You don't control time. You don't control when it will happen. Rejoice because if truly you have faith, you will know it has no choice but to happen. This matter I just shared with you. It's different from the faith that concerns another person's will. Mm. When it concerns the will of another person, the control of the will, yeah. it is witchcraft. To support a man in his cause, the Lord does not allow you. God will not allow you to use witchcraft. I say, I have faith that she will come to me. They are not coming to you. Yeah. <laughs> Some people don't know this faith thing is working. They say, Lord, I have faith that that brother Ramoke should come. Lord, I was believing that he would come to me and he didn't come. I'm backsliding. Please. Run. <laughs> when it concerns the will of other people, it is praying you must pray. Yes, Subjecting it to the sovereignty of God. Are you listening to yes, me? That Lord have your way in this matter. I desire this from okay. And she does not agree, Lord, let your name be glorified. That's a honorable prayer. Mm. If it concerns the will of another person, God knows how to touch that person's will in your prayer. Mm -hmm. The heart of a king is in the hands of the Lord. Yes, sir. Like the river course of water. Yes, he turns it in the direction of this one. This is a one. So don't go into witchcraft to say that, Lord, this person should have told me, oh, God, it's not coming. <laughs> what you do, are you listening to what I'm saying? Sides and you pray and say, Lord, and you have the peace of God upon the matter of God that's giving you a word on it. No problem. Be kind, be relatable. The intelligence to make that person happy will come to you. Yes, sir. Mm. The intelligence to make that person appeal will come to you. You just notice that you are at peace with the matter. You might not have all the money, but you are at peace on the conversation. Mm. Yes. Am I making yes. Ah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir. Don't forget where I said it. The greatest joy of using faith. Is that you believe God, yes. not that you got it. Yes. Yes. Does that mean you will not get results? Some people believe God for their results. The Bible says they died believing God. Mm -hmm. But their name is the Hall of Faith. Mm -hmm. Their name is the Hall of Faith. You are trusting God for your healing, and maybe you didn't get it. That is the joy. I trust that God is for the God. And you are still living life. Do you guys get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. 
Just to go for one million, one million lock up. Come down. As I said, it goes, it grows by use. It grows by use. The more you use it, the better you are. Before now, I had never put 10 million together at once. But now I've handled 30 million once. Do you understand? Yes, I, didn't have, I didn't even know where that, how do you spend 30 million before? In one book. I don't understand. I'm sorry. You guys know what I'm trying to say? One time I was trusting God for to you to hold $10,000, 2013. I held it $10,000 by faith finally and handed it to her to a froster. Oh, I don't laugh. <laughs> What then and now is a loss. It's 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 a loss. Guess what? I borrowed it. Yeah. And with interest. She's here. 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 Ten thousand people they put one and like that. The thing that pushed me. The guy pushed me. Guess what? I now put that ten thousand dollars along with one point two million. Oh. The joy was that I believed God for something. To get into one process that I felt was good. The guy, I did my background, my due diligence, everything. When he left and it did not happen, I didn't die. You know why? Because God held me. Mm -hmm. Now I've done bigger than that. Yes, yes sir. Mm -hmm. I've done bigger than that. This is loss. This is loss. Yes, sir. When you lost my life, my life, oh, I've paid those guys, I've paid everybody, I've settled all of them. Because I really wanted to plug in that I was trying to was our big break, you know that kind of thing. And it was for the heart of God. You guys know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. So, did it help you? Yes, sir. So start with small, small things. You want to eat your fries, start with all drives. You want to drink my wine? Yes. You want to preach to large people, start with small people. Mm. Yes, sir. Mm. Start small. Fix all your hearts. Mm. My job, look at me now. Mm. Yes. You know, some of you know that. Even when people multiply, I'm still preaching like this. Yes, sir. Yes. When they were looking, when you never even got home, when you never come, when we were in a smaller room, I was vibrating like I was talking to thousands. I was sweating when three people said to me. Mm. I believe God, sir. <laughs> that the God that comes. One can bring ten thousand. That's what I believe. People are saying, "Well, now we have this church always been there." You guys know what I'm saying. Yes, sir. To believe God for small. When we got married, I got married into a two-bedroom. When Mama entered, she said she's not staying here. I said, "Well, I'm not staying." She has not stayed. I said, "She that." So I stay here. The lockdown leads she turned it into a home. We stayed there for eight years. Eight years. I had two beautiful boys there. Fantastic world. Made the best of what we could do. When we look at that place, we wonder how we stay here. <laughs> but at that time, we trusted God. We trusted God. That's all we had. We had more. And I was on TV. I was on radio. <laughs> I was paid 1.8 million per quarter, not per annum. My house rent was 450,000 per annum. And I was enjoying Jesus. I was enjoying Jesus. Just serving the master. Do you understand? Yes, sir. It's just, it's just, 
logical. You know, so there, there's something just tell God I have any little something to give it. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, yes sir. sir. Now let me quickly say this. Anytime your faith looks like it's on the news, are you listening to me? Interpret the situation in favor of your faith. Number one. Yes, always. Number two. Because God will not be caught up in the mixture of your feeling. Number two, when Jesus spoke to Peter and said, Thy faith need not fail you, he told him, I have prayed for you. The solution for faith not to fail is prayer. Do you know what I should Look 22 verse 30. Huh? Yeah, 22 verse 30. So. Okay, that's the Proverbs 21 I just put it. Where so far he will, you see that? It's God's will. In Luke 24, 30, 22, 30. And Luke 22, 30. Luke 22, 30. It's 22, 30, yeah. So he says, 30, 22, 30, back. Uh-huh. 21, 31, church will not get one, 22, 30. It's just horrible. I got to close, got to close. 21, 30, 21, 30. I, I made mean, him see 22, everyone wow. He says, um, your faith will not fail you. Where is that? It should be 22 now. Was it 23 or 24? It should be 21 or 21. Check it for me. I obviously will not fail you. Jesus was talking to Peter. Eh? I've done this last week. 22, 32. Sorry. I know it's 22. Then check that 22, 32. It's all 6. 22, 32. Said Peter, don't mess me more than this. Yes, yeah, 22. What did I say before? 22. But I have prayed for thee that thy faith fail not. So faith can fail. And the solution to faith not fail is pray for thee. Intercessors. Intercessors. If nobody is praying for you, it's trouble. Nobody is putting your name on his lips in a day or in a month. It's not a good thing. Whereas you have offended somebody that is cursing you constantly till you fail. And nobody to advocate for you by prayer. No pastor is praying. Pastor said, does not know your name. No friend is praying. Friend that has eaten beautifully a lot of people. Nobody puts your name on his lips. It's not a good thing. Whereas even conductor look at the body that way. The bottles was full counterbalances those causes. I think it will not work. When cost plenty will work. It will work. See, see not, not me, do not me. Nobody is put your it's not a good thing. I'm telling you, you should believe what I'm telling you. Just many people cussing you, cussing you, cussing you, cussing you say nothing will work. It's lie, it doesn't work. <laughs> So I guess what I'm saying. Yes, so for example, when you bring an offering, amen. amen. Your man of God is a man of God. We pray. That prayer is different. Yes. Yeah. Amen. 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 Remember, man of God. Yes, sir. You pay tight. It's not me that gives the tight. Yes, yes, sir. Because some of us just really are paid the tight. I've given God, I've given all of them joy. It's not joy. Me mm-hmm. too, I pay tight. Yes, sir. Amen. Somebody gave me 10,000. I removed 1,000 and transferred. Tell me what to do. Would you give me by the tight? Will anybody give Will you? Mm-hmm. But tighting doesn't go to you, man. It's good that you give. Amen. 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 It's good. I'm not saying you should bring all your money here. And if you bring it, I'll collect it to the village. Amen. And it shall turn to you for a testimony. Amen. That's my prayer for someone tonight. Amen. That's my prayer for someone tonight. Amen. Everything you've been through will turn to you for a testimony. Amen. Don't forget your pain. You will use it to encourage somebody. 
Don't forget. Don't forget. Be encouraged. Take what I'm telling you seriously. Yes, sir. I'm not just interested in just preach, preach, preach. I want you to succeed. Take what I'm telling you seriously. When you are in prayer, don't sleep off. Don't sleep and say, ah, ore mini, ore mini. So when we start to see the manifestation outside. <laughs> Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, you know, I told that thing that when people are embarrassing you publicly, check how well you have honored God. Mm -hmm. That's all. You just like, did they grow up? No, 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 no. Something is wrong. It has happened to me. I was enjoying the measure of honor. Something is wrong. I said something has happened. Something has happened. They don't talk to me about it like that. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk to me like that. Those are checks. You're just, just losing money. You're just losing money. These are just falling out of your pockets. Oh, God, that's what the kind of. Mm. It's not just be going like that. I am not bothered. Mm. So much in the ceremony. It's not it's true. Yes, no. sir. That philosophy. It doesn't have to tell everybody. So, my prayer for you tonight is that it shall talk to you for it. Amen. Amen. How many is that to pray? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Shall talk to me for a testimony. Can I hear you pray? Take up your voice and Everything I've heard, everything I've been through, we talk to me for a testimony. All I have, all I want, all I want to be will talk to me for a testimony. My crisis, my challenges, my shortcomings, my friendships, talk to me for a testimony. In this period of this fast, Lord, let it turn to me for a testimony. Are you praying to me tonight? Lord, talk to me for a testimony. It will turn to me for a testimony. It will turn to me for a testimony. Are you praying? I've talked to you about the importance of prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Psalm 103, verse 20. I want us to use to pray. Just two prayer points. I'll pray. We'll take communion and we close. I want to try to finish there yet. Are we blessed tonight? Yes, yes sir. The prayer I want us to pray about tonight is about strength and speed. Mm -hmm. Strength and speed. Hallelujah. You know, it's a month of us. You will get strength in the name of He said, Bless the Lord, ye his angels that excel in strength. Your angels excel in strength. I say your angels excel in strength. I say your angels will excel in strength. I want to say that even like you understand. I say your angels will excel in strength. And they do the commandments. Hallelujah. Hearkening unto the voice of the Lord. Are you listening? Yes, sir. You are going to declare tonight. The Lord, I receive strength. In that me, I want to think about it in terms of when you say you receive strength, you are speaking to your physical self and your virtual self represented in an angel. That your angels also receive strength. That the battle they must fight, they will not lose. That they will excel in strength in your favor. That they, look, angels from time, Kalaito died last month, my angels, that they were fighting. And Gabriel had needed Michael to come and help him. Yes, sir. You know the story. Yes, sir. Some of the things the whole time. It's still happening now. Yes, sir. The Bible said, Josh Christ finished fasting, and angels came to encourage him. You need food, you Lord, my master. This place must be begging you by now. Jesus, where did I just fall? Like Jesus. You know, no, Jesus. Angels, they do wonderful things. Some of you, your body is paining you. An angel needs to massage you tonight. <laughs> Some of you, they are calling your name somewhere. An angel should show up like fire there. Yes, yeah. So you just stay there, you just think you are helpless. No. So you are going to pray tonight. Yes. And as you are praying strength, I want you to see your angels getting strength. Oh, yeah. Turn it to prayer. I want to hear it. Yes. Pray. Yes. 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 Yes.
Prayerlessness can be very terrible. The Bible says Daniel was praying. Daniel was praying. Imagine if he was not praying. With a fast. This fasting and prayer, your angels will gain speed. Let's read the next scripture. Do you have the next verse? Bless ye the Lord. Bless ye the Lord. All ye his hosts, ye ministers of peace, that do his pleasure. That do his pleasure. He says, he means a lot. Let's quickly read um, one of four verses. One of four verses. Um, one of four verses. So the next chapter. And then also do Hebrews 1. Verse 7. Let me clear up. See, this same thing was recorded in Hebrews 1 7. Just said. So this is one of four. four. See, he said, who make it his angel spirits? <laughs> what does that mean? Do you know spirits don't walk nice. like you are walking? Like you are constrained by gravity. Mm. If spirits are coming, they teleport. Yes, are you aware? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> spirits don't, they don't say, I'm coming, I'm coming. They don't take the amount, the amount of time you take. Mm. Spirits transfer. They show up, they appear. May your angels gain speed. Amen. Amen. Flaming fire. Mm. Flaming fire. 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 That is at their appearance. Fire is burning. Fire is burning. Fire is burning. Consuming fire. Consuming fire. Consuming every kind of mischief. Consuming every kind of destruction. You are going to pray tonight. Lord, make me a consuming fire. It's an attribute of God. Are you hearing what I'm saying here? Pray it out for yourself. Thank <laughs> you. 
Say submit you know. Do you know what that means? <laughs> that your name, you know that people are called names. It doesn't concern you. People can call your name anytime. And they will not give you a lot. What's call your name tonight to hey, you sugar pray? You're submitted. No, 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 no. It's anytime. You don't know when it will happen. Hello. Yes, there's a gentleman who told me that his family went to go and check who I am in the spirit. <laughs> Check. And through, through that period, as I was going, I was seeing eyes. Yes, yes, yes. I've told you before, so then we in that world I told you I used to visit. Twice it happened to me. I can't like tonight. I told you. Yes, so. <laughs> I don't want I don't add to anything. Just take me at my honesty. I saw the I said, look at these eyes, looking at eyes. It was one little I told me. When they check you, they will see fire. You may think I'm just joking. I'm not joking. No. I'm not joking. When they check your children, they will see fire. will be fire. I want to urge you not to miss the remaining part of this fast. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know the thing about this cosmic fire? It's not only protect you, it will consume whatever is consumable. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It will consume everything that is shakable and consumable. I want us to pray tonight one more time. And Lord told me to a pillar of fire. That my appearance brings light, fire and consumption. Make it a prayer. level of authority. So what you do for me, as you are taking it from yes, here, sir. please start to prophesy. Start to prophesy. Are you listening to yes, me? Sir. Nothing dies in my hands. I become infallible. I become stronger than my enemies. Are you listening to me? Tonight I want you to please hear what I just said. You have become stronger than your enemies. Amen. Are you listening to what I'm telling yes, you? Yes, sir. I don't have any, I don't have any. I'm not the one that made them for you. Yes, sir. But they exist. Yes, sir. Their joy is to see that you fail. They are probably cooking evil for you and you have no idea about it. So don't be innocent tonight. Are you listening to what I'm yes, saying? Sir. Don't don't be saying that I know no. Am I not a pastor? Am I not a preacher of the word of faith? I'm telling you now it's time to do some vengeance and justice. Yes, sir. You hear me so? Yes, sir. It was a song. Please eat with faith. Amen. You are the reason I live.